Well, welcome everybody. This is the encouraging word for Wednesday, and we are so glad to have Art with us again. And so he's going to be sharing a word with us and just uh, giving us some encouragement from the word and from the scripture and uh, then praying with us. And I just want you to know that uh, God is with us. He is for us. He is not against us. And so, uh, Art, why don't you go ahead, brother, and share uh, a word from the Lord. Thank you, Pastor. Um, the word for uh, this afternoon comes from uh, Mark chapter 4, verse 39 and 40. And this is a very familiar story of how the uh, disciples were in the boat and the storm came raging and they uh, thought they were going to perish. They, they were in dire straits, so to speak. And so they were wondering why the teacher didn't come and save them. So he was asleep in, in the bowels of the boat. And so they said to him, Teacher, you do not care that we are perishing? Then he arose and rebuked the wind and said to the sea, Peace, be still. And the great winds and the wind ceased, and there was a great calm. But he said to them, Why are you so fearful? How is it that you have no faith? God does not want us to live in fear. If your faith is as small as a mustard seed, you and the Holy Spirit within you can overcome any obstacle that come your way. The scriptures say that the just shall live by faith. Faith in God and faith in yourself. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. What Jesus was saying to his disciples there at the end of this passage was, listen, you had enough faith to calm the sea, but you didn't do it. So you didn't really need me to calm the sea. You could have done it yourself. And so the Lord is telling us to exercise the faith that we have, even if it be as small as a mustard seed, that we can overcome the obstacle that arise in our lives. Thank you. So Art, why don't you go ahead and, and pray for us and just pray that God would calm the seals of, of our hearts um, as well as just whatever else the Lord would put on your heart. Father, we thank you for this opportunity that you've given us to uh, share the words of life with your congregation, Lord, and all those that might be listening. Lord, we know that uh, none of these things that are happening have caught you by surprise, Lord. You are still the Lord of lords and King of kings. Lord, you're still on the throne. And Father, we just ask that uh, your Holy Spirit would calm those that are fearful today. And Lord, we ask that you would be with us and that uh, your word would be deep in our spirit, Lord, and we would be able to calm the troubled seas that come our way. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen and amen.